Today I wanted to talk to you about the blessing over the bread. Hamotzi lechem min ha'aretz. Now, this blessing is when you eat bread, it covers it. Or if you have a big meal and you eat bread, it covers all the foods that are on the table, except wine. Now, before we do this blessing, we do netilat yadayim. This netilat yadayim is different than the one you do in the morning or after you go to the restroom. We do this blessing, according to Shulchan Aruch, you do it two times on each hand. But our custom is to do it four times, and it goes against the Yud K Vav K, which is the secret name of God. Now, for the blessing over the bread, we need salt. And when we're going to bless it on the bread, we're going to say, Potech et yadecha. And there is a special code when we say, Potech et yadecha, which is, Pei Alef Yud, Samech Alef Lamed, Chet Taf Chav. Pei Alef Yud stay, stands for the first letters of Potech et yadecha. Chet Taf Chav is for the last letter of Potech et yadecha. And Samech Alef Lamed is a special name that draws sustenance to our lives. And I'm going to demonstrate. Now, you're going to see me, when I'm going to cut the bread, you're going to see me take the first piece and put it on the side. This custom, by the way, is according to the Zohar. Now, I'm going to do Netilat Yadayim. I'm going to take it in the right hand, and now I'm going to do it. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם אשר קידשנו ממצוותיו וציוונו על נטילת ידיים. עיני כל אליך אסברו, ואתה נותן להם את אוכלם ביתו. אמרו, פותח את ידיך. פי א' י', ס' א' ל', ח' ת' כ', י' ב' נ'. הוא משביע לכל חי רצון. ברוך אתה, אדוני, אלוהינו, מלך העולם, המוציא לחם מן הארץ. We didn't eat the first piece. Why? According to the Zohar, the evil urge is waiting for us in the first piece, in the first bite. So we're making a restriction. We're going to take the first piece and we're going to throw it away. And we're going to eat from the second piece and so on. Good luck. <laughs> 